Dear Young Zay, I hope this letter finds you well and full of dreams. First, I wanted to tell you that I love you. I know you didn't hear that a lot growing up as a kid, but just know that you will always be loved. The relationship you have with your parents will somewhat be rocky and traumatizing. Just always remember that they did their best to give you the life you have now. Your relationship with them will get stronger, deeper, and more meaningful the older you become. There will be times when you feel isolated, alone, and neglected, leading you to question things like, who can I trust? What is my purpose on this earth? Do I fit in, or am I meant to stand out? I promise you that all of those questions will be answered on your journey. I won't lie to you. You will face tons of adversity, from dealing with racism, almost not getting into college, and even contemplating quitting basketball. At times, you'll feel picked on, not accepted, and most importantly, the need to change who you are just to fit in. Despite what's ahead and more, just keep going. There will come a point in time when you make one of the hardest decisions of your life. This decision will involve challenges and setbacks as you embark on your journey to finding God and your true purpose. You will create a platform where you speak on your mistakes, passions, and your life lessons. Your voice and opinions will be heard, valued, and appreciated. You will become the man you were destined to be. Never lose sight of your passion, heart, and determination to get through what you go through. When you look back on that major decision, it will be one of the greatest risks you take, allowing you to change your whole perspective on how you look at life. Lastly, I ask that you trust what God has planned for you and be grateful for all you have. I know it won't make sense at first, but I promise that after everything you experience, the good and the bad, you'll thank him when it's all said and done. You have a bright future and much more life ahead to achieve greatness in this world with God being with you at your every step. Always remember that God loves you even when you might not love yourself or feel worthy enough. He put you on this earth for a reason. Don't let the opinions of others change who you are at your core, Zay. Don't allow pride, stubbornness, and the ways of the world to affect the uplifting spirit you have inside your soul. You have a true gift, an infectious personality, and a smile that can light up any room you walk into. Treat your friends, family, and even strangers with sincere love, respect, and selflessness, and you'll live an eternal life. Stay blessed. Sincerely, Isaiah Ruffin.